Hola, hope you're having a great day. This video is going to show you how to load image data into SimVascular. SimVascular takes a few different image types. Uh, it takes VTI, meta image, which is .mha or .mhd, uh, and DICOMs. I'm using SimVascular on Mac. We have it available on Mac, Linux, and Windows. Um, the DICOM reader is best supported on Windows. Uh, sometimes there's issues on Mac and Linux depending on how the DICOMs are formatted within the folders and uh, what they've been created from, whether that's a GE or Siemens machine. Um, so uh, I find that the best way to load them is either as a VTI or a meta image. Um, so if you have trouble loading in DICOM images on Mac or Linux, then you can go ahead and use what I usually do is I use Volview or ITK Snap, some other software, and convert to a VTI or meta image, and that is usually imported pretty easily into some vascular. Um, so I'm going to load a VTI right now to show you how that's done. Um, so image data, VTI, I've got this VTI here. This is just from one of our example data sets online. And now this big blue bo box shows up, and that means my image data has loaded. And just to make sure, I can scroll through some of the, uh, the slice plans here and just show that my image data is all here. So the three different views, um, and then I can do a point cloud if I want to show that. And ISO surface as well. So that's, that's just the basic loading of image data and some of the ways you can look at it quickly and kind of see what's going on. Um, if you'd like to see more about that, just go ahead and post here if you have any specific things you want to address or specific data sets. Uh, go ahead and ask about that in the forums. Um, so hopefully this helps uh, get you your image data into some vascular. Uh, so thank you very much and hopefully you have a great day. Thanks.